All right, we're going to look at some big varieties and see what we got here. It's what we picked today. This first one is Petite Negra. Afraid it might be a little early, but I believe it'll be all right. Petite all bake, I'm sorry. That's what that is. Petite all bake. It probably could have went another day. Yeah, petite all bake. But it's still good. This next one. Called a Dom Ramada. I don't know. I think it could probably win another day, but just looking awful dark there. We'll see what it tastes like. It's probably not as sweet as the last one, but the texture is really good. It's got a kind of a berry flavor. Kind of creamy. Another day it would have benefited it. This next one is White Triana. And I thought it was awful soft up there, so I picked it. Ooh, that don't look too good. Oh, no, it's all right. Yeah, it's got a little mold in it. Yeah. I don't think that one's, uh... I think I'm going to pass on that. Usually they don't look like that. That's what happens when they split at the eye. Alright, let's look at Floria. Yeah, and I'll tell you, they're, to me, they're pretty much... Minskarinska 10, Faria. Pretty close to being the same thing. It's pretty decent. It's just kind of sweet. It's got a little bit of a floral flavor cut, but it's very mild flavored. Very mild flavor. The thing is, is you get a lot of them, and they're usually pretty close to being first, so that's great. And being they are mild, they do you, they, that you can really bulk up your jam and get some poundage with them. It also has a light seed punch. That's something that I miss out on because I I, I got no teeth. So this next one is. Weeping apple pie. Now, is it weeping apple pie? Or is that? Yep. This is actually, actually, this is Boral. Interesting. Maybe that ain't Boral. So, I'm not sure what that was. I haven't tasted another fig like that this year. But it sure looks like the one that come off of Burrell. But Burrell's normally not red on the inside, it's more purple. Let's cut this one open. This is weeping apple pie. Got just a little bit of Nasty in the eye, I'm gonna cut off. Ooh. See how good this one is. Let me 
Nice and sweet. So I like this too much like the apple pie has it. Interesting seed crunch. Don't taste too much like an apple. But does have a good seed crunch to it. Has good seed crunch. Here's another cool little honey fig. This is LSU champagne. That one. It's really sweet. That, one. that one's really sweet. Mm-hmm. I don't know, it'd be a tough run to see. That might be one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. This one, I'm thinking about this might be Campanieri. You definitely got to pick it a little early. All right. So, try this one next. Mm. You see, it's kind of a mule thick. Got that collar. Moral day can ever. Hmm, that one looks perfect. Hmm. It's a light seed crunch. Yeah, and they're usually pretty creamy, ain't they? And sweet. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I like the creaminess about it. It's a creamy berry. Mm -hmm. like it. Yeah. All right, so this is kind of unique. This is Pastelier. Every one that I've had, I think they are a lot like a plum. Mm. Pretty good looking thing. Got, see, it's got quite creamy. a bit of moisture in it. It's creamy. Mmm. Watery. Yeah. But it's kind of a texture. A little bit more like a pear. But. It got a little bit of a pear flavor to it. Not a pear, I'm sorry. Plum. Plum flavor. Does it taste like Not a pear, watermelon? Not pear. Plum. To me, it's more like a plum. To me, I bet it tastes like a watermelon. I didn't really taste no watermelon in it. Now, this last one is a little bit of a mystery. Mm -hmm. I bought this tree. And it was supposed to be Montenegro. Or not, I'm sorry. Parrot Jaw Ramada. And it looks fairly close from what I've seen of a ripened Parrot Jaw Ramada, but it's not variegated. And the figs are just green. And this is what they turn to. So we're going to see what the inside of this looks like. Interesting. Yeah, because that really looks like. It very well could be a reverted Parajal Ramada. What's that? It lost its stripe. I have Montanica Ramada up there that's got a branch on it that's just got all green figs on it. And somebody accidentally probably sewed me a branch like that and this is what we have. It's a most likely a revert. We're going to see how this tastes. And if it's what we think it's going to be. Interesting. We'll find out here. Oh my. Yep, that's probably Parrot Jaw Vermont. Crunchy. Mm hmm. And the flavor profile. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh wow. That's good. That is really rich, sweet berry. Um, mm -hmm. That one just got a spot in the ground. I don't care what it's reverted to or from. Or what it even ever was, this is a really good fig, and it's ripening mid-season. Mid-season, so Delicious. it definitely just won a spot in the ground. Yeah, it did. It's good. Mom wanted that. 
I'm sorry. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye.